to the channel, you guys. In this video, I'm gonna share with you guys what's going on with a battle test here. Now, this is the new improved Meguiar's Ultimate Quick Detailer versus the Sonex Brain Shine Detailer. Now, in this video, the only thing I want to know, guys, is which one of these products is more hydrophobic than the other? Is they comparable? Are they the same? Now, price-wise, the Meguiar's Ultimate Quick Detailer, this is a new improved formula. It runs like $14.99, pretty much at Walmart, AutoZone, Advance, pretty much everywhere. They run about $15. Bucks. Now, Sonex, you have to order that one off Amazon, somewhere like that. And they run around $15, $16. So, price-wise, they're about the same price. The Sonex is 25.36 ounces. And the Meguiar's is 24 ounces. So basically they similar in size too. So let's get busy with it guys. I'm going to shoot two coats of each product. And I just want to see if one of them is be the water the best. Alright, so uh, let's get busy with it. Here we go. Doesn't take but a little bit. Doesn't take but a little bit to do this little test area. That's what it looks like. It looks kind of funny once it hits the panel. This stuff. It's got a funny look like some kind of um, oil. Uh, I'm thinking this stuff got something in it like a silicon or something like that. I'm not sure what's in it because for those of you familiar with a lot of detailing products, y'all know that the Sonex brand is made in, uh, I think it's Germany. It's not a U.S. brand, you know. So I'm thinking it has silicon in it. I could be wrong, though, you know. So uh, let's hit it again. That's all we need. I need uh, just a little bit for this little test area that we use here on this panel. Wipe that on in here. Okay. Let's flip the towel. Stuff is very slick on the panel. I talked about it a lot before, but not, you know. I just want to test it up, get some of that new formula stuff out there. Alright, that's that for Sonex. Now, let's come over here to the Meguiar's, and we're going to put two coats on the Meguiar's. Here we go. Alright, like I told you guys, doesn't, doesn't take a whole lot. Just a couple squirts, and wipe it in there. take a lot of it. Don't take a lot. Tempted to try that chemical, guys, pretty soon. But I thought the price would go down. But I see it ain't so bad to try it anyway. Alright, this is the second and final coat with the Meguiar's Ultimate Quick Detailer. And let's wipe it on in. Now, I think uh, $39 is a little steep for ceramic wax, in my opinion. You know, uh, that's just my opinion, you know. <laughs> I think some of you guys think the same thing, too, you know. But I may try it soon. Oh, no, man. It's, it's, you know, it's a little bit pricey to me for a ceramic wax. All right? So here we go. Then some people claim it fails, so I don't know. All right, that's that for that. Let's look at the shine and gloss between the two. Here's the Meguiar side. Here's the Sonex side. As far as gloss, it's kind of hard to really tell without a gloss meter, you know. By the naked eye, even with a meter, can just tell you uh, which one I'm giving a little more gloss. But by the eye, it still ain't going to make that much of a difference, you know. Somebody look at it, you know, it's, it's the panel look this good and slick. You ain't gonna be able to tell a whole lot of difference in the shine by the deck of eye. I don't care who you are. So anyway, let's get us like a little water test. We're gonna start off with the Sonex Brilliant Shine Detailer. Here we go. As you can see, that Sonex is very hydrophobic. I tell you guys, it doesn't take a whole lot of water to see how hydrophobic a product is. Oh man, that thing. <laughs> That Sonex Bridge Shine Detail ain't no joke. Look at there. 
stuff like magic, man. Check it out. The bees ain't no joke. You can't ask for better bees than that. That stuff lethal, man. All right, let's come over here to the McGuire's Ultimate Quick Detailer. Let's see that. It's hydrophobic as well. As you can see. Focus in, Cam. Focus in. Okay. I would say one is just hydrophobic as the other. As you can see. The Meguiar's is just as hydrophobic. And that's what I'm looking for. Okay, let's go back to the Sonex. Like the Sonex B is just a hair, a hair a bit tighter. But it ain't enough to really call, you know what I'm saying? They about the same price. I would say get both of these in your arsenal. One is just as hydrophobic as the other. One is slick as the other. But I don't know which one I'm going to last longer than the other. Uh, they're just so easy to apply. I would eat, that wouldn't even matter to me. So, uh, till next time, guys. Hope you enjoy. Hit that subscribe. I'm out. Peace.